Here's a quick test of a new JPEG decoding library. I'm particularly excited about this because uh, this is a thing that has been missing from the Arduino world for quite a long time, is high quality JPEG decoding. Uh, Larry Banks just announced this on Twitter the other day and, uh, and published some benchmark results. So I decided to give it a try. I grabbed uh, six random images from the internet and uh, put them onto this SD card right here. And, uh, and you can see it's working. It's showing this little slideshow program I wrote. Uh, Larry does uh, some amazing optimization work and I wanted to put these benchmark numbers to the test. So I uh, have this little push button here which will disable the delay between the frames. And let's see how fast it runs when I push the button. Ha 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 I really like that a lot. So if we look at the code very quickly, uh, you include it as an Arduino library like any other, then just three lines open the file, decode it, and close the file. And as it decodes the pixels, it calls this function for you to decide what you want to do with them, and we're just drawing them to the screen. So each file will call this function many, many times, and, uh, and then you can see the results back here <laughs> as it's displaying the pictures. Let's just let it run at full speed one more time so we can see how fast Larry's code is. Here we go. <laughs> I really like that a lot. So Larry actually offers a, a commercial optimization service. You should check out his Twitter account and uh, some of the amazing work that he's done because this is truly amazing decoding speed. Admittedly, it is running on Teensy 4.1, which is a very fast processor, but uh, uh, in the microcontroller, microcontroller world anyway. But uh, this is a really, truly incredible speed that Larry's achieved here, running on a microcontroller with a very small amount of memory to decode a JPEG.